A Cordova woman has been able to rekindle her artistic passion in a new way, leaving her mark at this year's Christmas Village in Birmingham. Yeah, Janie Carter was injured in an accident in 2017. That accident almost claimed her life. It left her paralyzed below the neck and took away dreams of her playing volleyball. But it opened the door, she says, to changes for other people's lives. CBS 42's Jen Cardone is reporting on the story tonight. She's live at the BJCC and Jen, she says she can't control what happens to you, but you can control how you respond to it. Absolutely, Sherry, and it's advice that she lives by because she does not want this accident to define who she is. Now, because of technology, she's been able to tap into her artistic ability to create watercolor designs, that just like the one on the back of her business card, to not only change her life, but the lives of people around the world. Code. Designed by passion, painted with love, Janie Carter shares her gifts to accompany yours this Christmas. It made me realize I have a purpose and that I'm doing something good. In July of 2017, Carter nearly lost her life in a car accident on her way to volleyball practice. She now has some movement in her legs and upper body. She's not going to let anything cut her down. Carter's nurse, Jerrica Woods, has been by her side for four years, helping to bloom the business. All of these, plus everything online on her website, started with one card. A pandemic card to her mother in 2020 when she could not buy her one for Mother's Day has been Boom to this, every holiday or occasion you could imagine. I hope it brings a smile to their face. Paper by Janie watercolor greeting cards doing just that. You want to support your local people. Calissa Gann says she drove to Birmingham just to see Carter inspired by her passion. In our small town, I mean, she is a big deal, you know. I mean, that's a huge um, accident and, you know, to come about and make a name for yourself, that's, that is awesome. Signing autographs for her fans, changing the world one card at a time. It makes me really happy that I'm reaching so many people with my story. In two years, Carter has sold cards across the world, including Sweden and Australia. If you'd like to meet her this weekend, she's going to be here at the Christmas Village on Saturday and Sunday. You can meet her in person or check out her designs online. We've got all that over in the CBS 42 News app. Reporting live in Birmingham, Jen Cardone, CBS 42 News. Local coverage you can count on. She isn't.